Round. This is the semifinals of round two. Uh oh, watch out. And Anthony Adele. Anthony the Hunter Adele taking on Johnny Lawrence of Cobra Kai. Look out, armbar. Oh, lock in the arm as well. Anthony Adele, the, the Hunter, looking to end this thing. Johnny Lawrence with a huge win over Jojo the Bodybuilder. Anthony Adele defeating Eric Bischoff to get here. Tossing Johnny Lawrence out of the ring. You gotta wonder if you're Anthony Adele, how do you take taking on someone like Johnny Lawrence? Anthony Adele who competes actively in both wrestling and multiple martial art events almost every weekend, provided someone is tough enough to challenge him or answer their challenge. Anthony Adele doesn't back down from a challenge much like his other brothers don't. He is the eldest of the Adele's. Johnny Lawrence, of course, legendary Johnny Lawrence, known for getting in a scrap here or two. Has a history of winning tournaments. Of course, Cobra Kai coming into an end soon. But Johnny Lawrence here to show that he's still an icon and still alive and kicking and, and definitely an icon of, feels he is an icon of MMA, so here he is. And Anthony Adele happy to oblige anyone who vows themselves as an icon of MMA. Jawbreaker by Lawrence, first really offense he's had so far, more of a defensive move really. And now Lawrence finds himself in the driver's seat, so to speak. European uppercut. Adele sent into the cage. Oh, watch out. German suplex through the cage. That's a move usually Adele's like to do. Lawrence turning the page. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Lawrence going to the top of the cage. And this is how he trapped JoJo the bodybuilder earlier. Of course, the Adele's have a history of, so far in this tournament, we've already seen the Adele's do horrific things to people on top of the cage. So I don't know if Lawrence is really ready for this as he is deciding to pose. Ouch. Maybe Lawrence is up for the challenge. Watch out. Lawrence working on the arm. Taking it to Anthony Odell, neck breaker, top of the cage, stopping on the f face, drop kick to the face, right on the edge of the cage there. He's got to be careful, Odell does, almost tumbling out there, and Lawrence lighting up with those kicks. And now that more kicks, and uh oh, got himself caught in a Kimura. And the Adels excel in submission wrestling in that Brazilian Jiu Jitsu that they have. And Anthony himself has multiple victories over that very maneuver right there. His brother, the winner of last year's tournament, Ty the Devil, excels even more so in the Kimura. Uh oh, and Lawrence, not quick enough to get that kick on. And now, Anthony Odell. In the driver's seat, giving Johnny Lawrence a tour of the city through the cage to the floor. Ouch. And I said that the Adele's do excel in taking people and making them regret going through the cage. Lawrence is up and down, and that's a point for Anthony Adele. Lawrence mocking uh, Anthony Odell was not such a smart move. I don't think I would have done that per se. There's a shot to the breadbasket. And now what? Well, Lawrence with a reversal. Good for him. Finger in the eye. That's going to stop things. Snap there off the ring. Kick to the head. Trying to get some offense going is, is what Joy Lawrence is trying to do. Of course, Anthony Odell getting back to his feet. Lawrence is looking for a toy. It's a chair. 
European uppercut. So far, Anthony Adele has the first point. After Lawrence went through the cage, suffered the wrath of being thrown around the ring. What's dangerous about the Adels is just the fact that, especially Anthony Adele, is how he excels in both wrestling and Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. And I believe both things combined are a dangerous combination when it comes to combat sports. Having some training myself, which I'll be in action later, training not in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, but in Chun Kudo, along with Judo, Muay Thai, boxing, and amateur wrestling, those things are going to come into play. Kenpo, Judo, Muay Thai, boxing, all of those things I am trained in are vast. And that's one of the reasons why I did very well when I competed, and we'll have to find out later on when I put my old school skills to test. As Anthony Adele, who I believe one day, if he wishes to, he would be the future and the headliner in the UFC someday. As he, he's taking Johnny Lawrence around the ring right now, and Lawrence has really had no response but he knows to get away from that that maneuver. Dragon leg screw, and that's it. That's all it takes. I, I don't know if I've ever seen anyone lose to a dragon leg screw, but Anthony Adele has absolutely decimated Johnny Lawrence. Look at this. German suplex through the cage, and then this right here would be a point. And then right here, just twisted that knee, and that was it. Well, this should be a very interesting matchup, folks, because Anthony Adele is about to go to the finals.